And the tourism sector has grossly underperformed. That pronouncement was made by Minister of Finance, call member, during his budget presentation in Parliament on Monday. The finance minister revealed plans to revive the local tourism industry in both Trinidad and Tobago. Dion Batiste has more in this report. Independent analysts, both local and international, are full of praise for the tourism potential in Trinidad and Tobago, but lament that the sector has grossly underperformed. That was the assertion made by Minister of Finance, Calm Embert, as he presented the 2018 budget in Parliament today. In response, Minister Imbert said government has taken bold steps to rectify the sector's shortcomings. One such step was the closure of the tourism development company, which has been replaced by two companies tasked with marketing the unique characteristics of both islands. The combined destination of both locations, Trinidad and Tobago, will provide opportunities for both experiences through strategic marketing and promotion. We are establishing for the first time a regulatory authority, the Trinidad and Tobago Re Tourism Regulatory and Licensing Authority, to ensure that the tourism product in both Trinidad and Tobago meets and maintains international best practice, adherence to which will be monitored. Minister Imbert said government has already moved to forge closer ties with cruise lines and strengthen marketing efforts in a bid to increase port calls. He also disclosed that government is moving rapidly to complete the facility at Maracas by January 2018. Commenting on the proposed construction of a Sandals Resort in Tobago, Minister Imbert said discussions have been progressing nicely. It's 22 hotels based in the Caribbean will contribute significantly to the branding and marketing of Tobago as a tourism destination. It will also catalyze the expansion of good quality five-star rooms, provide a boost to stay over arrivals, and in the process generate employment opportunities and spill over activity both in Tobago and Trinidad. In keeping with the government's plan to stimulate the tourism sector, Minister Imbert proposed that the hotel and guest house stock upgrade program reimbursement cost be increased from 25 to 50 percent. He also proposed that government subsidize loans for new tourist facilities by 5 percent. Dion Batiste, C News.